Shalom family. Police in the UK stood by as the slogan from the river to the sea was projected onto Parliament on Wednesday night, according to a senior Jewish MP. Andrew Percy, a Tory backbencher, raised concerns after pro-Palestinian protesters beamed the slogan onto the Elizabeth Tower, which houses Big Ben. The campaign against anti-Semitism said the projection of genocidal language onto Parliament was a wake-up call for Britain. Police officers were present in large numbers at the demonstration in Parliament Square, but decided not to take action. The Metropolitan Police later said it could not intervene because broadcasting a slogan onto Parliament was not a criminal offence unless the message broke the law, which officers did not believe was the case. There's no doubt that the chant is genocidal. It denies Jews self-determination in their homeland. It calls for the destruction of the state of Israel. And more importantly, it is chanted by people and promoted by groups who are in many cases openly anti-Semitic who call for Jews to be wiped out. So according to the police, it's not criminal to openly chant and show symbols that push for genocidal intent, completely wiping out the Jews, is quite fine. But I guarantee you if they had something up on the building there with Big Ben saying they'd like to wipe out every British person in Britain, that would be a different story. But don't worry, it's just the Jews they want to kill. So, no harm, no foul. Welcome to the end of the Age of Man, where things get dark really fast and are accepted because no one's pushing back hard enough and they're scared of the evil that they've already allowed through the doors. Pray for Israel, pray for the Jews, and shine your light while we still have time. We fly soon. Shalom.